Hello folks, hope all is well. Got another little job to do on this uh, 66 plate edge. I've got the uh, power shift gearbox I'll change. So um, what I've got here, just my measuring jug. I've got seven litres of this transmission oil. One of these lovely shiny new ones and a holder for it as well. I have, now I have driven the car for about say 20, 25 minutes just to warm the oil up. Um, Cause you're supposed to get the gearbox up to about 40 degrees. But before I change them, I will start the engine on, engine up again, run it through the gears before emptying it. Just get everything ready underneath first. So we've got to get this on the tray off. Now they're all done up by a Torx. It's a T30. We'll just go through and undo them all. Get on there. And there. So as you can see, you've got your power shift gearbox here. You've got the front sump there. You've got the rear sump there. And you've got the filter just can focus properly. And the filter just up the side here, which we'll get to properly when we take the shield off here. So I'll probably turn that wheel to this side just so I can access it a lot easier. So 10 mil there. Undo that. And then we have a couple of bolts just here. Under here, I thought what I'll do is I'll just crack these off. That's it. So I know they're loose when I drop it down. Sneak up a little bit. And that one at the back. <clears throat> just tighten that back up a little bit. That's it, that's loose. Right, I'm gonna drop it down on the floor now. Right, so we bring it back down on the floor, get the top piece off. I'll do this for 20 seconds. That's in sport now. Right, so that's two and a half litres out. Now we go see what comes out the rear. So while it's still draining, I'm going to get this taken off. So we get this airbox off. To get this thing off, get this loose, get these two bolts out. There's two here, one there as well. Seven mil. Right, we'll just loosen it up. Before I take it out though, I will blow all the crap away from it completely. I 
there's the filter. Now it does have a little clip on the other side. Now you probably noticed that you're not gonna get a 32 mil socket on there because of the uh, subframe. So we have to get it off a different way. Just doing this now anti-clockwise, which is, always oh, clicking. Right in the, right at the top of the filter, if I can get to focus, there is a little Anyway, as it will drip all over with the uh, old filter. Now you can see that clip just there, right there, clean up the whole area. And we need filter. It does go in that way. Fluid in here first. Just gonna put some transmission fluid in there. Fill up. Probably about halfway. Yeah, and then I'm gonna pop that in there. Just gonna put a little bit of uh, oil just on that seal around there. So it doesn't get caught. Let's lock the new filter in. Screw in as much as possible. So it's nice and get by hand as much as possible. Obviously, I can't get any of a socket, so I will have to use my tool. Now. now you don't over tighten these. I see it's tight now. And I give it a little bit of a clean up. Let's put this back in. See when we do fill her up. The uh, check in the level is right there. That little set, that little bolt there. Okay, and we'll undo that shortly and uh, check the level. <coughs> Let's uh, get the bottom timed up. So I've tied up the two some bolts. Okay, I'll put the torque below. Um, that's all tight now. That'll all be cleaned up in a minute. Five liters so far. Let's make sure there's no dirt. We do not want to get any dirt in there at all. number two I missed that, but I actually just put another litre in there. So I had six litres in total inside the gearbox. Okay, now I'm going to put it over to 
covered in dust getting in there. Right, so what we're going to do now is we're going to start right, run it through the sink and then we're going to check the level. So now I'm just going to put the bung back in. Right, I'm just going to kick this up just as I stop the car. It doesn't bring no error codes up. In reverse, and we're going to wait 20 seconds. Into neutral, into drive, 20 seconds, into sport, 20 seconds, back into drive, 20 seconds, reverse, 20 seconds. Or is actually I'm in neutral. Reverse 20 seconds. Go into park. Engine off. And now we're gonna go and check the levels. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna undo this again. Do the muffs like that, turn it off. Gonna undo this bung. Again. Like that. Put that in there for a moment. Ready? Right now. Vehicle is level, I've checked that out. So now we're gonna go and check the level of the oil. Nose dripping out there. I'll wait until that stops. And then what we're going to do is we're going to put some more oil in the top once that stops. Right, she's stopped now. Just pour a little bit in. Fin. Oh, yeah, I'm not going to show you me pouring it in. I'm pouring more in until it starts dripping out of this thing again. There you go, she started dripping again now. That means level fill, so I'll just wait until the stop slows down. That's it. Go back in. Clean up. Okay, so we're all back together now. Let's come back in. And put the airbox back in. In. No, it won't, not there. Oh, it did go. Close in. Let's do a new filter there. Let's go and pick up a new filter for it. The filter's a bit dirty, we we'll do for the moment. On. I've got one of those clamps, but I can't figure where I put them, so I'm just going to put this down for the time being. Right, 
right, okay. So if we just clear, clear it up a little bit, clean up. Over here as well. Let's give it a little bit more dry. <laughs> That's about done. That's it. We're sorted.